Tea Talk with your host Naeem Kanikol. Subscribe, like and share. Tea Talk, where we sip and spill that tea on celebrity gossip, pop culture and mainstream media. She'll be sipping and spilling that tea. Tea Talk with Naeem Kanikol. Welcome to Tea Talk Toronto. I'm your girl, Naeem Kanikol. Happy Wednesday. Word of the day, whoopee. It's Wednesday. It's women. It's whoopee. Okay. She's in the news and we're going to talk about her. Mm. We're also going to talk about the cornrow bandit, Mr. Jermaine Dupree. Yes, check out those cornrows, okay? About, hmm. Okay, we're going to talk about Whoopi Goldberg. Whoopi was my first godmother, okay? She was the first woman I look at, like, you know, when I think of Harry Tubman, <laughs> Rosa Parks, like people, you know? That's when I, that's how I look at Whoopi, you know, because I didn't know them, but I know Whoopi, so I always put it together. But she's in a little bit of hot water, a Black History Month. Let me tell you, mm -mm, not my Whoopi. What she said was, you have to Google it, because as I said, YouTube is very sensitive and I'm trying not to get in trouble. The page is growing. I appreciate your support. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Tell a friend to tell a friend. So if you Google it, you'll hear what's happening with her. But I have a message for her. And this is my message. I get it. You've been with The View for a very long time. And I do not want you to leave yet. And I'll tell you why. You need to march out of there. <laughs> And I'll tell you why. You wait until Black History Month is over. What's the next month? You're going to march out of there and you're going to leave an international day. You're going to leave on Women's International Day. Okay? So you're going to wait till Black History Month is done. You're going to wait till February is over. And you're going to march out of there on Women's International Day. That's when you leave the view. That's my advice for you, okay? Because you know why? You and the view is like a relationship that you're outgrown, but you're still in it. Uh, all you know what I'm talking about, right? Have you ever been in a relationship and you know it's not going anywhere, but you're just there because it's comfortable? <laughs> or you're scared to be alone. Some people stay with people because they don't want to pay rent. So they'll catch up in your place. So they... You, you, all right, all right. <laughs> okay, it's Black History Month. Let's pull it back. Let's pull it back. So that's my advice for Miss Goldberg, okay? Stay. Um, do what you got to do. I'm not going to repeat what you say, but they can Google it. I'm sure everyone knows it's trending. But that's my advice. We're not going to leave if they suspend you because I see something about you get suspended. That's okay. I say you come back, but you got to leave in a powerful way and march out of the view in 2022. Okay, that's what we do. We're marching out of stuff. All right. Let me move on. <laughs> uh, Jermaine Dupree said um, that dating Janet Jackson, other women find him attractive. And, you know, that's his reason for cheating. <laughs> and I kind of understand what he's saying because, you know, sometimes you, these men and them, if you look at who they does date, and sometimes when they date you, you have to wonder. Remember that? Mm -hmm. Mm, I always wanted to um, pose like that, you know. I remember, yeah. Black people extra, eh? Them I go to court, look at them dress up. Everybody, even the mother. What's the mother? You know, I'm bad, I'm bad. Who's bad? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> okay. So, Jermaine Dupree said women was all over him for dating Janet Jackson. So I guess before he started dating Janet Jackson, nobody really cared. He probably used to bang people. Nobody want um, people to know they're banging him. You know, like some men, they always banging women and they don't want nobody to know about them. They keep them home. They hide them. All of a sudden, baby come and you're like, what? <laughs> you know? <laughs> so I guess, you know, women used to date him, but he wasn't good enough for the streets. And Janet Jackson gave him the chance and then he just turned up. No, nobody wants you until the cool guy on the basketball team or the football team. Vice, you know those ones? Mm-hmm. Or oh, the hot girl. 
the hot dog girl from the group or whatever give you a chance and all of a sudden yeah man a lot of people walk around with insecurities you know i tell you they have to bang in the dark <laughs> they can't walk out the road with people you know they have to hide them <laughs> so me understand his insecurities but really and everybody is dragging him. And let me tell you something. All you have to understand. This is why I don't understand society. Where is Tupac Shakur when you did it? You know what I mean? I will never understand this society, okay? All you want the truth and all you can handle the truth. The man come and he's speaking his truth. Okay? <laughs> he cheated. <laughs> yes. He friggin' cheated on her and that's the reason for the breakup and after that we never hear from him again not everybody could be nick cannon you know hollandy not everybody could be nick cannon okay he date mariah he do the most now he's just having babies all over the place the difference is he can take care of it you know some people just have kids and they can't take care of it you know they just end up all in um child support court and all kind of nonsense mm -hmm. Grab your coffee, grab your tea, come and sip and spill with me. It's Wednesday. And we're talking about the Cornwall Bandit, Mr. Jermaine Dupree. From the moment you see here like that, Janet should have known. Look at Janet compared to him. He looked like a little <laughs> boy. She looked like that is the mom and she stopped. Um... Janet got cheated on. Beyonce got cheated on. Halle Berry got cheated on. I got cheated on. <laughs> it is what it is. There is things in life we cannot avoid. A cough, sneezing, cheating, and falling in love. It is what it is. What are you going to do? All you need to leave the people relationship alone. Everybody's mad and I'm like, why are you guys mad? Why you guys are upset? This is not your relationship. You guys are there on Twitter dragging the man <laughs> doing the most. The truth. Sometimes the truth pill is what we want, but we can't swallow. You know those ones? Everybody wants the truth and can't handle it. When they get the truth, they throw a temper tantrum. They want to do the most. How you get them, that's how you lose them. I'm your girl, now you can call as a safe and spill the tea. That's all I have to tell you for this lovely Wednesday.